The imperfect tense is used to describe actions that took place in the past. So in the imperfect tense is a past tense conjugation of the Spanish verbs. Imperfect is used to talk about past actions that don't have a stop or end time, to describe people, places, and situations in the past, and to describe what was happening when another action took place. For AR verb endings, uh, we're going to use jugar. Remember that when we're changing a verb, conjugating a verb, all we're doing is changing the ending. So in the yo form, it's going to be jugaba. And in the to form, it's going to be jugabas. Let's get that top there. Uh, Eliea who gaba uh, nosotros and nosotros who ga with an accent who ga vamos and then ellos ellos and ustedes is who gaban. So the endings are ava abas. Aba, abamos, y aban. In the ER and IR verb conjugations, we're going to use comer and vivir. Okay? Now, again, we're only changing the endings. So in the yo form, it's going to be comia and vivia. In the two form, it's Comias and vi vias. In the LNA form, the singular form, it's again the same as the yo form. Comia and vi via. In the nosotros form, it's comiamos and vi viamos. Finally, in the eos, eos, ustedes form, it's comian and vivian. So what you see here is just like in the preterite tense, the ER and IR verb endings are exactly the same. If you have any questions, you can message me at srdenim, senior denim, or you can make a comment below.